What is good, YouTube? And I'm back again with another video. You guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail. Got another machine for the channel. Uh, 2021 Polaris Sportsman 570 Trail Edition. Went to the dealer to drop off that other one because the brake caliber broke the one with the lift on it. And seeing this at the dealer, it couldn't resist. I love this black color and the blue accents they got on the shocks are blue, blue, just the blue accents. And the newer body style, these things are nice. I like it. I just go give you guys a couple specs on it. Uh, you guys know what all the specs to be planning on buying. Uh, 2021, one of the newer model 570, because they redid this model. Most of you guys know they didn't have the newer model in the 570 until 2020 and 2021, I believe, but this is 2021. Uh, so, this complete package is all you'll get when you uh, uh, get the 2021 570 Trail Edition. Start off, uh, it comes with a 2,500 pound winch, black hook, comes factory, comes factory with front bumper, uh, uh, rack mounts, little rack holder things on whatever these things called. I don't know. But come with these racks up here on the uh, rear, give you some support. Come with a rear bumper too, and it comes on 26 by 8 by 14 inch power grip, like an all terrain mud trail tire. 26 by 8 by 14 in the front, and 26 by 10 by 14 in the rear. Good all terrain tire, mud. Uh, trails, nice time. And as you guys know, I got from a good boy down in Greenville Equipment Center in Greenville, Alabama. They hooked me up. This is a single cylinder, four stroke motor, makes 44 horsepower. Pretty quick. Uh, come with these nice rims, nice blacked out rims. Uh, yeah, I know the new one come with the digital dash. And the suspension is so soft, it comes with a digital dash, glass, yeah, 4x4, 2x4. I get the automatic, comes with power outlet right there. And I don't even know what this is for. This right here, I don't even know what that's for. Uh, high, low beams come with the head of your headlights. Uh, Lights too. Uh, come with front storage compartment. Let me show you guys the front storage compartment. Kind of to put the battery up here too. Yeah. Front storage compartment and the battery comes up here too. Pretty nice spot. That's what I mean. That's what around it. But yeah, you guys, nice, nice machine. Like I was saying, you guys, the nice ACV. I had to pause the video or well, cut the video right there. See how you get the seat off. But yeah, I figured it out. You just had to pull it up. Uh, that's the airbox, and the airbox snorkel goes up in there somewhere. And yeah, like I said, it's a single cylinder engine. One thing I hate that they did with these models: why in the world is the belt box belt box ain't take like that? A big old hole for anything to climb up in there, or bird fly up in there while you got it parked. Or even mud slang up in there while you're driving. That's about to be one of the worst things I can ever think of what they could do with that. They could have at least ran it up here to the plastic or something. I don't like that at all. Have to figure something out. More than likely, probably go put some snorkels on it. Just because. Cause I do not like that. That's about to be one of the most slowest things I've ever seen. But yeah, uh, independent rear suspension. The shocks on the thing are so smooth. Uh, yeah, guys, just about it on it. Nice quad, 2021. 20, uh, power steering comes on the 570. I don't know why they want you to put power steering on the 850 high lifter like they do the 570, but I understand it's a higher trim than the high lifter, but come on, man. You put, a, you put power steering on the high lifter. Yeah, I don't. Ain't rough to turn. Hey you guys, uh, airbox intake right there, snorkel intake right there. I mean, belt box intake, rear diff, 
Oh, yeah. yeah, this is a nice quad. I like it. Plan on owning, plan on owning all ATV brands. I got Polaris, I got can I got one Kawasaki. Plan on getting a Brute Force 750, a Grizzly 700 or 450, it really doesn't matter. And a Honda. I want a Honda. It really doesn't matter what type of Honda you get. All of, I just want one to go in puns and stuff with my big tall snorkel. I've been looking for a Honda 300 for the longest, but I can't find one. A clean looking one. I don't want no clapped out, dirty, mistreated Honda. I want a clean Honda 300 four tracks, four by four. So if you got one, you're looking to sell it, let me know in the comments. But yeah, you guys, that's gonna cap it off for this video. I'll give you guys a good walk around on it. Uh, gonna do some riding with on it soon. Uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video. Oh, and I want to thank you guys for 1,600 subscribers. And yeah, I really appreciate all the people that subscribed to me. Uh, in the bottom of my heart, thank you. And let's just keep growing, you guys, together. Thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you leave us a uh, subscribe, hit the subscribe button, and leave a like if you're new. And that will cap it off for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.